Hey friends, this is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead, and today we're going to make grain-free Scotch egg meatloaf. Okay, here's what you're going to need. Now folks, before you get all excited and tell me this isn't Scotch eggs, no it's not. It's my Scotch egg meatloaf, that's all I call it. Okay, you're going to need a pound of ground meat. I have here uh, venison and pork mix. You're going to need some steak sauce, ketchup, whatever you use to season your um, meatloaf. This is my homestead steak sauce. You have three hard-boiled eggs, one regular egg, some dehydrated zucchini, spaghetti squash will probably work, and of course one cup of minced onion. Let's get started. Okay, my camera wasn't running. In my mixer bowl here, I've put my meat, my onion, and my egg. Now, as most of you know, I'm having issues, or had issues, I got very ill trying to um, eat gluten-free baking products. And those were homemade, so I have an allergy issue. So we're just going to do the best we can. We're not going to throw out the baby with the bath water. We're going to try some new things that with what I've learned. This is about a cup of my dehydrated shredded zucchini and we're going to use it in place of breadcrumbs. Okay, so we're going to, I'm going to say about a half a cup of ground dehydrated zucchini. And we're going to put in I'm going to say about a quarter cup of my homestead steak sauce. We're just going to mix that up. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to take half of my meatloaf mixture and press it down into the pan. Just like this. And then I'm going to lay my hard boiled eggs end to end. I probably could have used more, but and we're just going to pack our meatloaf around the eggs. Now if you want to bulk this up some more, I just want to make sure my eggs are covered. If you want to bulk this up some more, you go ahead and add some oatmeal. But I'm trying to keep this grain free. So what I'm doing here is I'm making it a more of a loaf. Let's push that egg down in there just a little bit more. We want to make sure those eggs are covered. Okay, there we go. This is going into a 350 degree oven for about 35 minutes. We'll see you when this comes out of the oven and we'll see what Papa thinks. And here is our scotch egg meatloaf with no grain. Let's get Papa to the table. Warm up. This is scotch egg meatloaf and I didn't put any bread or grain products in the meatloaf. I used ground dehydrated zucchini. Mm, very tasty. Awesome. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead saying even if you can't always go gluten-free there are many ways to replace grains in your diet. <laughs>